We made it to Esperance. We're in Esperance. I've not seen anything that blue and clear in my whole life. W-A, wow. <laughs> This sand is like talcum powder. We got an oil leak. Hanging out with the legends, Carlson and Max and Zuri. Probably one of the coolest chopped GQs. It's a chilly 21 degrees today. We made it to Esperance. We're in Esperance yeah. and the water is so blue. Yeah. Like I thought we'd seen blue water in other <laughs> places, but this is next level blue. It's crazy. We've just come down to the uh, Esperance beach just out the front of our caravan park. So um, yeah, yeah. We, we checked in because um, we were last minute. We were just walking. So we were quite lucky. We checked in. We've got an allocated spot. So we yep. went and did our groceries. Um, Stopped in, had to get some emu export beer. It's like, uh, must be a Western Australia tradition to get emu export. So, <laughs> never tried it before, so I grabbed a six pack of that. So, I'll give that a good nudge tonight, I reckon. And yeah, now yep. here we are. <laughs> Just taking Sky down to the beach. Talcum powder is so soft and fine. Oh wow, feels so good on the feet, especially after being on the Nullarbor for the last four days in the dirt and the dust. It's such a nice change to be on a pristine white and blue beach. Oh, I can't get over it, how blue it is. It's magical. Another 40. back there though yeah <laughs> we have booked um three nights was it yeah three nights three nights at the rac caravan park in esperance but with, there's so much to see in esperance around the area that we wanted to come investigate for the day and it's a bit of an overcast day yeah so we thought it would be uh, less busy we went down to the jetty got coffee this morning and uh, now we've come down to Blue Haven Beach. Oh, it is stunning yeah. here. Even on an overcast day, it's, it's incredible. incredible. Yeah. And dog friendly, so this guy's been running around, 
Yeah. Sniffing everything <laughs> and yeah. But yeah, I can now see what people say about WA. Yeah, it's insane. It like, is. It's so blue. <laughs> what we've seen so far, WA is the best state. Yeah, so far, hundred <laughs> percent. So. I mean, they they all have their own um, individual good things, but yeah. so far, as soon as we've rocked up to WA, the bush camping has been unreal. <laughs> Red dirt, salmon gums, like it's just stunning. And then you get to the coast, and it's just so blue yeah. and white sand. And it's like it's not like sand that it's in Queensland. For some reason, it's like a different sand. It, it's very fine. It's almost like talcum powder. So we've been wondering, maybe that's why the water is so blue here, because yeah. the sand is different. <laughs> but yeah, even on a crap day, or overcast day, yeah. it's still stunning. So, so we're going to do more exploring today and we'll take you along with us. Have a look at this water and it's overcast. That is insane. Wow. That is incredible. And I can't, like, this is a overcast, not so great day. And have a look at that. Oh my god. I think I'm definitely gonna have to get the snorkeling kit out of the car because that is just incredible. It is so clear and so blue. Like I don't know if this video will do it justice, but that is incredible. I've not seen anything that blue and clear in my whole life. WA, wow, <laughs> insane. You know you're in Western Australia when they have sharp warning sirens going off. <laughs> tools are out. It's not looking good. Oh. We got an oil leak. <laughs> uh -oh. uh, so yeah, it looks like the um, the oil cooler housing gasket um, has finally decided to let go. <laughs> not too bad. It's only small. Um, but it, I think uh, the guy that well, the people that we bought this motor off when it got rebuilt, they just used like orange gasket goo. So, yeah, it's crap stuff. They didn't use proper gaskets. And um, yeah, we've got a small leak. So hopefully it was quite loose. So I've just um, nipped it up a little bit. I'm hoping that that will sort of stop the leak. But if not, 
it's going to be a um, pretty big job because I think the mm -hmm. the fuel pump has to come off. Um, yeah. Fuel filter. Fuel filter. Water pulleys. Water and pulleys stuff. and so yeah, it's going to be a massive job. <laughs> so thousands, but yeah, fingers crossed that just nipping it up does the trick. But I'll show you guys where I'm talking. Yeah. So yeah, as you can see, the orange gasket glue on that housing behind the oil filter there. That's where we've got our leak. So I've just nipped up these uh, those bolts just there, and they were quite loose. So hopefully, um, by nipping them up, sorted it out. So, but we'll see how we go. So we've Good left. Morning. <laughs> we've left our caravan park this morning. Yep. Um, unfortunately, we still have an oil leak. Yes. You tried a few things yesterday, doing the gasket seal and stuff, but... Yeah, I tried tightening it up. Um, I have a tube of, yeah, gasket sealer in a spare toolbox. So I tried, like, running my finger along and putting some of that on and, yeah, it has, hasn't helped at all. So, um, we're just at Repco at the moment, waiting for them to open. Um, it is Sunday, so nothing's really open today. <laughs> we tried on Friday a whole heap of mechanics, yeah. but um, a same. lot of them didn't answer, and it's probably because it was Australia Day on Thursday, so I reckon Long most weekend of them were shut. <laughs> yeah, they would have taken Friday off, but um, the ones that we did get hold of, they, yeah, no good flat chat, mm. the usual story, so. We're going to buy a bottle of oil from Retco and yeah, just take Make it easy. Make our way to Albany and see. Albany seems like a bigger town yeah. than Esperance. There seems to be a lot more mechanics and stuff around Albany. So um, yeah, I, again, it's Sunday today. So we'll just drive towards Albany, head that <laughs> way. So I think it's like 300 and something odd kilometers. Yeah. So we'll just have to keep topping it up. Um, it's not, it is bad, but it's not like, real bad mm. i just got to keep monitoring it so and then tomorrow we'll call up and yeah we'll start the <laughs> ring around <laughs> but we've I... got no plan now so we're just mm. i mean worst case it'll be a phone call to the insurance company um, yeah. because we can't keep driving it like this it's, no. it will get worse and worse it already has started getting worse so yeah it sucks it really sucks we'll see what stay happens. tuned yeah stay yeah. tuned did the Great Ocean Drive this morning and uh, we're making our way towards Albany. We just keep stopping every hundred or so kilometres just to yeah. check on the car. We've got 373 <laughs> kilometres to go to get to Albany so we just stop every hundred, pull over, check the oil. It's actually a bit weird like the, the oil leaks actually slowed down a little bit being on the highway and I don't know if that's because uh, first thing in the morning when you start the car obviously the oil is cold and thick so the oil pressure is quite high which pushes it out um, through the gasket and then obviously once the oil heats up the pressure oil pressure lowers um, so maybe it's yeah it doesn't leak so bad when it, the oil pressure lowers because um, yeah we've just pulled over and yeah it's not as bad it's still leaking but yeah. nowhere near as bad topped up oil 
keep checking it. So far, so good. So. So we just put some uh, chicken tenders in the, the oven. <laughs> yep. It's our new thing now. We saw another, um, I think it was a, another YouTube. Yeah, it was another YouTube channel. They yeah. do, um, they put chicken <laughs> tenders in their travel buddy and have um, chicken tender, cheese, and um, sushi mayo, QB mayonnaise yeah. wraps. And oh, so good. <laughs> be best so things. good, but so bad. Best but... thing since sliced bread. We, we've been having it. <laughs> heaps lately so <laughs> so they're in the oven and i guess we'll keep going and yeah yeah so hopefully see you guys at albany <laughs> <laughs> This car is a huge drive anyway, it feels massive. I think from Esperance to the stop is 500. Yeah, Esperance to where we're staying, um, it's Cozy Corner. Yeah. Um, we're staying at Cozy Corner tonight. It's a campsite, not a Cozy Corner. Yeah, <laughs> or a caravan park. It's an actual camp on the beach. Should probably let you guys know the reason why we're sort of doing this big stint and traveling this far and sort of pushing the car a bit to get here is we've been in contact with our family of legends that we've been following on youtube for quite a while now Carsten and maxine <laughs> and, and zuri in their combi yeah they said come down so Apparently there's plenty of campsites there, so we're going to push through today. We'll do the big drive. I think we'll probably get to Cozy Corner at around 6 o'clock, between 5.30 and 6 o'clock tonight. So we are so excited. I cannot wait to meet these guys and check out the combi. It's going to be epic. Legends, Carson and Max and Zuri. Um, yeah, we spent the night here at Cozy Corner and it's been awesome. Yeah, getting to chat to them, get to know them. Such cool people, like really cool people. And we've also met Justin from um, Mad Raptor. He's also a legend, he's camped here as well. So yeah, it's been great. We've had a great night and um, yeah, it's been awesome to get to know them. So. Hopefully we can keep doing some more adventures with Carsten, Max and Zuri. <laughs> <laughs> what an absolute beast. The combi. The legend. Oh, so cool doing it the right way. Chop GQs in Australia, I reckon. Thing is a weapon. <laughs> yeah, 
That sounds so good. <laughs> Here he is, the man. The hey, legend. legend. <laughs> Don't buy a combi. <laughs> no, as, do as buy know, a combi. hard. Yeah, it is. It's, it's so rewarding, hard. but it's bloody hard. <laughs> yeah. Absolute beast. So cool. <laughs> See you, legend. See you on the tracks, mate. Will do, yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> 40 Series Cafe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Legends. We had a great night. We're um, we're here for two nights. We're going to stay here two nights because um, it's just such a beautiful spot. We're at Cozy Corner. We're just bringing Sky for a walk down along the beach. So yeah, it's great. Dogs are allowed here. It is. Um, is it fifteen dollars? Fifteen dollars a night? Yeah, fifteen fifty. Fifteen fifty a night, and you pay through a mobile app, Strata Mobile or something. Yeah. Yeah, the pay station is not working at the moment. Yeah, but it's great here. We got there's drop toilets, yeah. um, no showers, but that's okay. We've got our own on board. So, but yeah, I can't believe it. It was such a great night last night. Got to have a few beers with those legends. So yeah, can't wait to catch up with these people again. And yeah, it's been great. It's awesome. <laughs> So you're not allowed to um, 
bring dogs down to Elephant Rocks or anywhere along here. Yeah, um, William Bay National Park, I think it is. Yeah, William Bay National Park, so. But it's a chilly 21 degrees today. Yeah, it's uh, it's fine for Sky to be in the, the dog box. She's got a fan on. Yeah. She's loving it in there. <laughs> yeah, so we just leave her in the car. It's not a big walk. It's only just down here, so she'll be right in the car for a little bit while we um, come and check out Elephant Rocks. best day for it <laughs> but hopefully it still looks nice it's just started raining as we've started this walk so hopefully it doesn't get any worse <laughs> I think this is the way to go to get onto the beach, but tide's too high. The tide's too <laughs> high at the moment, so we can't get across onto the. Well, we could if you're ready to swim, but um, <laughs> it's a little bit chilly today for swimming, so we'll just go back up to the lookout up the top here. That water just looks magical. It's so clear and blue. I reckon on a nice hot sunny day, that would just be next level, don't yeah. you reckon? Even the water wasn't that cold. Nah, <laughs> it's really tempting to go for a swim, but we got sky in the car, so we can't, um, can't spend too long down here. So, but it was good to stop. It's absolutely stunning. And there's all these like rock formations up in the mountains behind us here which look really cool. So just tucked away in the corner. What's it called again? Parry Parry Beach. Parry Beach. Yeah, Parry Beach camping area. Yeah. It's ten dollars per person per night. Um, luckily, we're in the tents only section because we've got the rooftop. So it's actually quite a nice little 
but Top you have to be it. yeah and you have to be under 2.7 yes, meters 2.7 there's a height bar <laughs> at the start of the um campgrounds so, yeah i just so, saw a um caravan waiting out the front and they're definitely not gonna fit no. <laughs> so yeah we're luckily 2.65 maybe yeah we just snuck through just. <laughs> but, so. yeah we're here for two nights we're gonna chill out Yep. Do some editing. It's nice just... to be in under the trees as well. Yeah. It's been a while since we've been in shrubbery. Like yeah. it's quite nice. So yeah. Hopefully the weather's better tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Movie night, Harry Potter <laughs> under our fairy lights. <laughs> Good night, everyone. Good night. Leanne was up late last, last night doing our editing up in the tent while I was watching Harry Potter. <laughs> so, yeah, we've just had our morning coffees this morning. Um, we're booked in here for two nights so we've got another night here tonight which is kind of good because at the moment we've got pretty miserable weather so we're just yeah kicking back relaxing um, and enjoying this cooler cold weather <laughs> It's always a good sign when you've got oil. Uh, just checking it because we've um, we've got about I think it's like a 150 kilometer drive tomorrow to get to um, Pemberton. So we lost a little bit of oil, but there's still plenty in there. So we're good. We're good to go. <laughs> All packed up. Yep. Off to the next spot. Today is Pemberton. Pemberton and Chores Day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we've got so much dirty washing to do and grocery shop and we've got to fill the tank up. So mm -hmm. yeah, today's gonna be Chores Day and then yeah, head to Pemberton. Yep. Pooch to catch up. <laughs> She's way back there. Sky! Doing her own thing. She's just doing her own thing at the moment. Sky, come on! Come on! She's happy. She's happy doing her own thing. 
Good wrap. Yeah, good wrap. Mm. Love the chicken tenders. Chicken tender wrap, mm. so good. With flies. <laughs> Don't eat one. You just get, you get every now and then you get a fly with it. <laughs> <laughs> 